Hi everyone, in this video I will mention 10 common problems that second generation Jeep livery vehicles are prone to experience. Number 1. The TIPM module in many of these vehicles is failure prone. Some of the symptoms of a failing TIPM are the following. The engine cranks but won't start. Engine stalls while driving. Power windows won't roll up or down. The horn goes off randomly on its own. Power door locks lock and unlock the doors on their own randomly, among other symptoms. To eliminate these problems, the defective TIPM module needs to be replaced. Number 2. The water pump in some of these vehicles becomes noisy and develops coolant leaks at low mileage. Number 3. The window regulators are prone to experience premature failure, causing the affected window not to roll up or down. Number 4. The heater core is prone to get clogged, causing the heater not to blow hot air during the winter. Back flushing the heater core before the cold weather arrives usually solves the problem. Number 5. The heater and AC blower motor resistor is prone to malfunction, causing the blower to only work at one speed. Number 6. The alternator bearings in some of these vehicles become noisy before 100,000 miles. They can be purchased as a kit that also includes the brushes as shown on the screen. Number 7. The AC compressor in some of these vehicles experiences premature failure, causing the AC system not to blow cold air. Number 8. The front wheel bearings in some of these vehicles are prone to become noisy and develop play before 100,000 miles. Number 9. The ball joints and control arm bushings are prone to experience rapid wear, causing alignment issues and uneven tire wear. As these items wear out, it's best to replace the complete control arm assemblies as shown on the screen and have the vehicle realigned after installation. Number 10. The hydraulic lifters are prone to get clogged and make ticking noises due to excessive rocket arm clearance in vehicles that are not maintained properly and the oil changes exceed the manufacturer's recommendations. Sometimes adding a cleaning additive to the oil solves the problem, but in many cases the lifters need to be replaced. There you have it my friends, those are 10 common problems that second generation Jeep livery vehicles are prone to experience. Take care.